Hey everybody, this is Pastor Tyler Baker of Valiant Baptist Church, and we are located in the Jacksonville, Florida area. I'm coming to you with part 10 of the series entitled, Jesus is Jehovah, wherein I am proving from the Bible, the Old and New Testament scriptures, that Jesus Christ was born of the Virgin Mary, was in fact the one and only true God, Jehovah, manifest in the flesh. Now, in one of my earlier episodes, I mentioned the basic teaching, which is found all throughout the Bible, of monotheism. Monotheism is the teaching that there is only one God. There is only one true and real God. Christianity and the Bible is very clearly a monotheistic religion. And the Bible's very clear that the one and only true God is Jehovah. Jehovah is the one and only true God. Well, with that in mind, I want to show you Psalm chapter number 89, verse number 18. For the Lord is our defense, and the Holy One of Israel is our King. So Lord there is Jehovah. And notice it says that he is the Holy One. Well, that makes perfect sense because there is only one God, and God is holy. That's why all throughout the Old Testament, this is a title that is given to Jehovah. Now, with that in mind, understanding the significance of this title, I want you to look with me at Acts chapter number three, verse number 14. Acts chapter number three, verse number 14 says, but ye denied the Holy One and the just and desired a murderer to be granted unto you. Now, without giving you the full context of this passage and just letting you know that the person preaching is the apostle Peter, and he's speaking to an audience of Jews that are located at the temple in Jerusalem. Keep in mind, of course, these are Jews that would be familiar with the Old Testament scriptures, very familiar. I want you to answer the question quickly, who are they going to think that he is referring to when he says, ye denied the Holy One and the just? As I said, this is a title that is given to Jehovah of the Old Testament. And of course, they're going to think that he is speaking of Jehovah. If I were to give you the full context, and you can go check this out for yourself, you'd know that he is actually speaking of Jesus. The person that they denied was Jesus. They rejected Jesus. They rejected him as their king. That's who they rejected. So when they rejected Jesus, do you know who they were rejecting? They were rejecting the Holy One. What does that mean? Well, of course, Jesus is the Holy One. This is not the only time in the New Testament that Jesus is referred to as the Holy One. Do you know the only two people in the entire Bible that are referred to as being the Holy One? You have Jehovah of the Old Testament and Jesus in the New. Do you know why? Because Jehovah, the God of the Old Testament, was manifest in the flesh. We have the record of him in the New Testament, and it is the Lord Jesus Christ. Over and over and over again, the Bible teaches very plainly and very clearly that Jesus Christ is the one and only true God, Jehovah. God bless you and have a good day.